How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches School! We all know school. Some of you are still in school. Others are just leaving. And some, like me, left many years ago. We all remember trying not to fall asleep in class. I once fell asleep in an exam and um, I started snoring and I woke up and everyone was laughing at me. What was more embarrassing was my results. <laughs> Thank God for YouTube. I'll be living in a box. And when we think about it, I guess we could all use some tips on how to not fall asleep in class. Which is why our good friends over at Troom Troom have made a tutorial just for that. Called 13 Secret Ways to Sleep in Class. They're not actually telling you not to sleep in class. They're telling you how to get away with it. I'm not sure that's a good thing. We've reacted to Troom Troom a couple of times on the channel and um... Well, we know it bugs me. We know we don't get on. It's because it's just, it's just so stupid. And it's the woman's voice. It, it, it does my head in. Let's take a look at how they suggest you could be getting away with sleeping in class. Let's watch the video. I need to study. Good how do I get to sleep? But you can take a nap mm -hmm. even at school. Yeah. I. Fuck, I can't stop this voice. You meant to be married to it! Honey, it's time to wake up! Oh, divorce her on the spot. I'll make a tutorial on how to divorce her. Enough playing around. Take your seats, everyone. But first, let's check for absences. Hmm. One, two. Let's check for actual children. Because this classroom is full of 30-year-olds. There's one student missing. Please don't let her be on the back of the door. Don't let her be on the door. Clearly, Yenny overslept again. We Clearly, Yenny is on the back of the door. She can't have done that herself. She needed help to do this shit. How is this a tutorial? Oh, yeah, yeah. Teacher's never going to notice that, innit? A student hanging from a door. And I love that they're learning the history of cinema. Is that a lesson? Maybe media studies. Yenny, back to your desk now. I'm shouting at her. She's in a jigsaw trap. She can't move. Get back to your seat. Now! <laughs> it's so hard to get into work mode after summer vacation. I wish I could sleep right now. Like, wh why do, why? Why does she have to talk like that? I, d I just don't, I don't understand how it gets it across. I take it this is aimed at like more younger people. God forbid it's actually aimed at high school kids. I, but I don't get how her voice Plants the seed, you know. I I don't get I don't get why she needs to talk, like she she takes the special bus. I don't I don't get it. I know something I can do. Get the magic glasses. Now Mr. Alex will think that Michael is still. Oh! Obvious, isn't it? Jesus. Uh, Timothy, you're either asleep or on a lot of crack. My God. <laughs> Michael wants to show off his knowledge. His eyes show how interested he is. Is that an answer? That? Is that an answer to any question the teacher might ask? I don't think it is. Why is he sitting still? Oh, so that's what's happening. Michael At least the teacher isn't um stupid in this sketch. Mind you, his head looks like the arse end of a My Little Pony. Look at that. That. That's... I think man buns are actually acceptable on some people, all right? I get that a lot of, like, ladies don't like them. But some guys can... Pull it off. That is an abomination against man buns and hairstyles in general. Geography is the most boring class ever. That's not. Who said who? Why? Why? 
Geography is quite interesting. I actually, I didn't really get to do much geography in my school. My school was terrible. I would have liked to have learned more. I left school not knowing where the fuck I was. We'll have to save hmm. the day. Mr. Alex, can I be excused? Go, but not. Why are you so close to Mr. Alex? What, what's that all about? Look, their tables are interlinked. Who wants to sit that close to the teacher? You can practically like stroke their leg. Everything is going according to plan. Now we have to sneak quietly to the alarm. And yeah, D don't rob a bank is all I can say. Doing that along a wall. <laughs> hey, what's what's the plan for getting in unseen? Don't worry, bro. I got it. <laughs> and he's like a secret agent on an important mission. There's the button. Don't teach people to do that. No! No, she ain't gonna do it. She ain't gonna do it. Push it! Hey, oh my shit. She pushed it. Not up here! Fire alarm! Everybody out! That was easy! Where's the fire? Hmm? Where's the other children? I swear to God... <laughs> I did not know that they would try and... I know this is like a sketch and it's not to be taken seriously, but this is meant to be... Life hacks, in a way. First of all, I shouldn't be teaching people to actually get away with sleeping in class. But why would you, why would you teach them to, to press the fire alarm? Run! Run! And I'll take a nap here. Good thing I have my headphones with me. And good thing your parents can pay the fine. Jesus Christ, all that for a nap. You're gonna evacuate to school so you can go to sleep in class. That's dedication. Sleepy, no sleeping. Listen carefully. Listen. What, hold on. I think I know where they're going with this, but I've already spotted it. Let's go back. What's wrong with this picture? Have a look. Keep looking. You feel that this guy has shrunk and is looking a little bit 2D. Please, <laughs> don't say he's made a cardboard cut out of himself. I can't, my brain can't cope. Listen carefully, literature- Oh shit. First of all, he's tiny and his legs are gone! And, uh, where would you go to get a cardboard cutout of yourself? Where would you go? Example from Michael, what a diligent student, sitting up and not even- He has an outline! He looks like he's been thumbnailed! Blinking. Oh, the bell rang just in time. But where is he? He set that up. He's somehow got away with it because the teacher is just one brain cell away from having a coma. Where is he? Michael, the bell rang. You can go now. He's got no legs. It's obvious. The glasses gave it away. It's not <gasps> Michael. It's his cardboard copy. That's smart. And the re Wait. So he went to school with a bad cardboard cutout of himself, propped it up on the desk with a cup, and then went home to bed. And no one noticed. No, no one noticed. This is meant to be a secret way to fall asleep in class. The bastard's at home! He's in bed! He had to go to school to get away with it! Still in bed. The prank was a success. No, it's not. Your cardboard cutout fell over. You're going to get detention. What's that weird sound? Hmm. Sounds like snoring. It's coming from over hmm? here. There ain't no way in God's nipples that you'll get in that locker. Who helped her in there? Not all students are a fucking contortionist. Oh, Annie decided to take a nap. The thing is with those lockers that I don't think you can open them from the inside. So this would actually have a very bad ending. Mr. Alex would find a dead bitch in that locker. I tell you, they'd smell her before they heard her. The start of the school year is hard, not- Right. Right. Off the bat. Okay. It- <laughs> I mean, you can see already he's painted his eyes. But <laughs> he looks so fucking creepy. Teacher <laughs> looks extra strict today. Mm. What's wrong? <laughs> I can't anymore. I can't anymore. That's actually quite a lot of effort to paint it that well. 
on your eyes. And um, I don't think Mr. Alex has blue eyes to begin with, so he's painted them the wrong color. Has he got blue eyes? But if no one can see it, then you can try. Hmm. Oops, the pen fell. Annie hmm. has her own hiding place under the desk. The bitch built a hammock. She built a hammock under her desk. But she still has to get up. What are you doing? Wait. Why do they... <laughs> Why have they got a soil? The Metal Gear Solid sound. Such a classic sound in gaming and they bloody stole it for this. Stop! Oh, I'm sorry. How long was I out? How long were you building that hammock? And how did you get away with it? When I was in class, I couldn't get away with shit. If I laughed, smiled, looked up in an exam. Damn, they were on that shit. She built a hammock. Why not to fall asleep? Where does Mr. Alex get his energy? Where does Mr. Alex get his teaching methods from? Why are we learning about the throat? What's he teaching? Energy. He needs a board right now. Look at that! Ear, nose, and throat. What are they learning to be or do? Oh. Wow! No problem. But it's actually a living board. Michael was hiding. The oh. Any worse. Today the students are talking about different cultures. Annie got India. No shit, she got India. Would not have guessed that at all. I don't I don't even know I don't even know if that's um if that's right. And Kim is about to tell us all about Japan. Oh god. <laughs> god no, no, stop it. Also great! Nice job, Kim! China is next! <laughs> Did you see? Did you see Mexico? <laughs> Wait till you see Mexico. Check out my kung fu. Mm -hmm. Careful, Mr. Alex. Well done, Lei. Apparently, um, everyone from Japan is a Mortal Kombat character. Who's that guy in the sombrero <laughs> in the back? He's probably going to tell everyone about Mexico now. No, he's a t he's come as Mexico because apparently he can get away with sleeping. If you're trying to get away with sleeping in class, just wait until it's um, nationality day and you get to dress up and be borderline racist and then you can come as um, Mexico and sleep. <laughs> Life hack! Mr. Alex knows a lot about Mexico too. My yeah, yeah, as he just displayed to the class. All right, kids, today we're gonna learn about Mexico. Next week, Japan! <laughs> History class is another challenge for sleepy students. Couldn't you have thought of a more interesting topic? What do you want them to teach then, love? So far, she hates everything. Everything's the most boring subject in the world to her. What do you want them to teach then? How to talk like a twat! Insert the flash drive, Anne. Program the mind to sleep. No, he's not going to hypnotize the teacher. Please, I, I will jump out my window right now. It's too late. This isn't a history classroom. It's a nap zone. It, no, it, apparently it's Hogwarts. Oh, God. Troom, troom. All jokes aside, you never fail to surprise me. Oh, Jesus. Guys, um... I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please don't attempt anything you've seen here. And if you do, I'm not going to feel sorry for you. Like, love, caress my channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay dazzling. Ha! <laughs>